And other than that, I just want to thank, from the bottom of my heart, everyone who made this and future projects like it possible because people in our industry and all the contractors I just mentioned know it, the recession has taken quite a toll on the working class families of Vermont. To have to have conversations over, are we going to heat the house or are we gonna feed our kids is a really hard conversation on on a one-on-one -on -one basis. And I know the legislature works really hard and I know the media prints data about jobs and what they mean, but what they mean to each and every person is the ability to stay in a home and to raise a family and to feed that family and to educate and, and clothe that family. And because of what the state has done and because of what David has done, and because of his people, our people, all the subcontractors and everything that flows from that, we were able to do that one more year. And we're gonna be able to keep doing that. And we were able to work with TIF and help train people so that they can do that for themselves. And as a born and raised Vermonter, I wanna be self-sufficient and I want my people to be self-sufficient, just like we want to be energy wise, we want to be family wise. So mostly today, I want to thank everyone for looking out for those jobs because there are people in those jobs and those people need those jobs. And for me personally, it helped me sleep at night, it helped me feed my family, and it helped me watch my employees able to feed theirs, know that the other subcontractors had employees that could feed theirs. So on a much, much deeper emotional level, I just want to say thank you to everybody up here and out there who made this happen. I am deeply appreciative.